Hi there. Uh, we are XGen, and today we're demonstrating 5G broadcast direct to mobile devices. You can see here we have two video feeds going directly into this Qualcomm reference device, which is just a developer phone. Also in the case, we have some more traditional looking phones, just so you get an idea that this is not just in early stages, it is slightly more mature. So we're talking to a different portion of the uh, 5G chip, Qualcomm chip, than the uh, cell networks talk to. It it's doesn't require a SIM card, doesn't require Wi-Fi. It goes directly from our transmitter to here to deliver video or data uh, of any type. Uh, yeah, I, I had nothing because... <laughs> explain this way. Yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll explain this way. So what, what we're doing, uh, what we're actually showing is that we're using traditional broadcast, as in we're letting people know that you get to use your uh, existing transmitter. All you need to do to do 5G broadcast is replace your modulator exciter to speak 5G broadcast to output your FE and BMS signal. And what that does is it talks to the base chip of the Qualcomm's uh, Snapdragon to where it'll look for that FE and BMS signal so you can capture that, convert that uh, signal into information and present you the, the feed and what we're showing here. And what's also great about that is like, now since we get to treat video as data, we can now provide emergency services through CMOS directly to the cell phone. So we can deliver emergency services in under a second. And what's great about broadcast doing that is we get to broadcast one to many, not uh, unicast where it's one to one or monthly cast, which is uh, one to few. It's better if everyone got the alert all at the same time. Um, another thing that we're also uh, pitching uh, and working with the FCC with is working with first responders giving them uh, more services and, and abilities to make their lives a lot easier uh, out in the field. So I don't yep. Just some technical details about what we're doing here today. We're broadcasting on TV channel 28. So we take an existing uh, uh, TV channel. Um, in this case, it's 557 megahertz. And we use that same six megahertz bandwidth to deliver to the phones instead. So we just have created a, a uh, experimental modulator uh, with our software-defined radio, and we just go out with the antenna and deliver to the phones. And for, as for the future, we think that reaching people where their eyeballs are on, you know, on a cell phone and delivering data in, a, in an efficient way is something that uh, is very exciting.